subscribe. Click on the bell. Like, comment, share. Observe the burning candle. What caused the physical changes? Experiment. Heating of naphthalene. Let's conduct an experiment to determine the melting point of naphthalene. Problem. How can we determine the melting point of naphthalene? What materials are needed in this experiment? Naphthalene powder, water. List the apparatus needed in this experiment. Retort stand, beaker, boiling tube, thermometer, 0 degree to 100 degree Celsius, stopwatch, wire gauze, Bunsen burner. Hypothesis. The temperature of naphthalene rises when it is heated. Variables. Manipulated. Time taken to heat solid. Responding. Temperature of substance. Constant. Naphthalene pressure. Procedure. First, fill one third of a boiling tube with naphthalene. Put a thermometer into it. Then, suspend the boiling tube in a beaker half filled with water using a clamp. Make sure the naphthalene in the boiling tube is fully immersed in the water. Slowly heat the water until the temperature of the naphthalene reaches 60 degrees Celsius. Start with stopwatch. Stir the naphthalene continuously and carefully with the thermometer. Record the temperature and states of the naphthalene at 30 seconds interval until the temperature reaches 90 degrees Celsius. Record the temperature rise in the activity sheet and plot a graph of temperature against time. As the temperature increases, the substance changes its state from solid to liquid. At 78 degrees Celsius, it reaches melting point. The heating curve. Do you know how heat affects kinetic energy and the movement of particles in matter? Click on the blinking button to proceed. During the solid state, kinetic energy increases with temperature. Click on the blinking button to proceed. The temperature remains constant because the heat energy absorbed by the particles is used to overcome the forces between them. Then, the solid turns into liquid. Click on the blinking button to proceed. During this liquid state, kinetic energy increases as temperature increases. Click on the blinking button to... During this liquid and gas states, Heat is absorbed to overcome forces of attraction. At this point, when kinetic energy is high enough to overcome the forces of attraction between the liquid particles, liquid change into gaseous state. Click on the blinking button. During this gaseous state, kinetic energy is sufficient enough to overcome the forces of attraction. Thus, the particles move freely at higher speed. Experiment. Cooling of naphthalene. Let's observe what happens to the liquid naphthalene when heat is removed. Problem. How can we determine the freezing point of naphthalene? What materials are needed in this experiment? Naphthalene powder, water. List the apparatus needed in this experiment. 
retort stand beaker, boiling tube, a large conical flask, thermometer, 0 degrees to 100 degrees Celsius, stopwatch, wire gauze, Bunsen burner. Hypothesis. The temperature of liquid naphthalene drops when it is cooled down. Variables. Manipulated. Time taken to cool down liquid. Responding. Temperature of substance. Constant. Naphthalene pressure. Procedure. First, remove the boiling tube from the water bath. Quickly dry the outer surface of the boiling tube and suspend it into a conical flask using a clamp. Stir the naphthalene continuously. Record the temperature and states of the naphthalene at 30 seconds interval until the temperature drops to 60 degrees Celsius. Record the temperature drop in the activity sheet and plot a graph of temperature against time. As the temperature decreases, the substance changes its state from liquid to solid. At 78 degrees Celsius, it reaches freezing point. The cooling curve Do you know how cooling affects kinetic energy and the movement of particles in matter? Click on the blinking button to proceed. During this gaseous state, kinetic energy decreases with temperature. During this gas and liquid state, heat is released and the temperature remains constant. During this liquid state, kinetic energy and temperature decrease. Click during this liquid and solid state, heat is released. The temperature remains constant because cooling is exactly balanced by the heat liberated as the force of attraction between particles increases. During this solid state, kinetic energy and temperature decrease. Heating. As the temperature increases, the solid particles gain kinetic energy and vibrate faster. The particles vibrate until the energy gain is able to overcome the forces that hold them at their positions. At this point, the ice melts at 0 degrees Celsius and becomes water. When more heat is absorbed by the water molecules, they move even faster and gain sufficient energy to escape from the surface of water. Then, they become sufficiently active to move freely and far apart. The water boils to form steam at 100 degrees Celsius. Cooling. When steam cooled, the particles lose energy and move slower. The particles lose more energy until they are closer to each other and form water. As the temperature continues to drop, the particles lose even more energy until they do not have enough energy to move freely. At 0 degrees Celsius, the water freezes into ice. Click on the blinking button to proceed. Summary You have learned about the interconversion of the states of matter in terms of kinetic theory of matter. When a substance is heated or cooled, its physical state alters. When heating a solid substance, kinetic energy increases with temperature. This causes the movement of particles to increase. A to B, the solid particles gain kinetic energy. B to C, the solid begins to melt at B, complete the melting at C and becomes liquid. C to D, the liquid particles gain more kinetic energy. D to E, 
the liquid begins to boil at D. Complete the boiling at E and becomes gas. E to F. The gas particles gain more kinetic energy as the temperature rises. When cooling a liquid substance, kinetic energy and temperature decrease. This causes the movement of particles to decrease. The graph shows the changes that take place in a substance when it is cooled. A to B, the gas particles lose kinetic energy. B to C, the gas begins to condense at B. Complete the condensation at C and becomes liquid. C to D, the liquid particles lose more kinetic energy. D to E, the liquid begins to freeze at B. Complete the freezing at E and becomes solid. E to F, the solid particles lose more kinetic energy as the temperature drops. Click on the blinking button to proceed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon.